Oh, and it's rotting. Oh, chill out, man. It ain't that serious. Anything in here? Nothing? Okay, uh, does it open? Oh, God. Hello, everyone. This is Bahala Gaming TV, and this is the channel that plays everything, so you don't have to. This game today is Layers of Fear. This is the older one, not the newest one. I plan on going through Layers of Fear 1 and 2 and the newest one. But for now, we're going to do the oldest and work our way through. All right, everybody, let's get into it. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. Finish what? Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. Oscar Wilde, the picture of Dorian Gray. All right, we are in. Look around for a second. Baby butt. It's a good start. Oh, baby's got more than a butt. All right, let's see. What is this? Oh, is that like a muzzle for a dog? We got the controls. That guy's... There's his kids and, uh... I don't know. Beating the woman, I guess. Let's open the door. Man, every dang game I'm playing has got a rats. Do you see that? It's like the last freaking five games or something. It's all rats. You kind of move slow on this one. What's this say? Sir, I didn't touch the workshop, just like you asked. Although, I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. Uh, somebody's getting fired, okay? Hear that attitude? Nope, we're not going down there yet. Yeah, let's just shut that door real quick. We don't want to go down there. Is there something here? Yep. Dear sir, we would like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialist, as well as refrain from sending us any more of our high, or of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of a rodent infestation of any kind, and as such decided not to act further than a prophylactic sprain. Please treat this letter as a final warning, or else the next envelope you receive will be from our lawyers. With best regards, Carl Denton, Pesky Pest uh, Pacification Company. Much longer, I literally just saw a rat run by. Okay, clearly they're not seeing it, or the guy I'm playing as is crazy. I think he's a dude. And we got... We dog collar? I can't see, uh, tell what this says. Longdale? Mulligan Avenue? And what is that? Pop Kill? Yeah, I don't know. You guys tell me what that said. We got the fireplace. Open the door. Oh, we got a nice kitchen. Anything in here? I thought this was like an oven. I guess these are just cupboards. This is the oven right here. I guess the wood would go into one of these. We got grapes. More things to read. Figured you'd be up all night, so I made you a little treat. You know, I bet even Rembrandt occasionally took time off from being brilliant and snored his head off like the rest of us common folk. I know. Gasp. In other words, get some sleep, you big dummy. I love you. There's no sleep for a workaholic. Just work. Nothing. Got some here. Paint. Rose door. Burnt umber. And sienna. Brushes. 25. Air fresheners. 50 pack. 
apples 10 kilograms and booze 30. Ah, 50 pack of air fresheners. This place must be stinky. We got some sugar in there. Paprika. Oh. Nothing in those things. Oh, I got some cauliflower. What do we got in here? Pantry? Sugar, oregano, paprika. Bought our oregano. Got some garlic. Okay, it looks like left trigger we can use to run. Good to know. Let's look around some more. Figure out what's going on. Oh, these open up. I'm sorry for yesterday. You were right. I overreacted. It's just that this isn't about me. It's about her. Everything I do, I do with her best interest in mind. I guess I've always believed that in an imperfect world, it's worth the strive for perfection. Ah, uh, now I'm starting to sound like my father. I will work on my temper though. Promise. We'll talk later. I love you. <laughs> Mummy's got a temper. I can hear the water on in the bathroom. But I'm busy going through drawers right now, so you're gonna have to wait. Got some pants, clothes. That one's locked. Something special in there. He's got the water on. Water bill's gonna be so high right now. We got a light. Oh, yep. The shiny floor. What do we got here? Achilles Prosthetics Company. 1x below knee prosthesis. How the hell did they fuck up the length? Yeah, that would suck. More lights. Rat poison. Effective when used as a bait, poison, water poison, tracking poison, active ingredients, a bunch of stuff. All right. Um. So this one down here is locked. You can open this. Little closet. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, all the rat traps just went off. Man, that is a lot of rat traps. Okay. Well, they put all the rat traps in one area. You know, in my experience, that would work. As long as uh, you know where the rats are coming from. Okay, let's open this one. Let's go down, I guess. See what's in the old basement. I think we need to find a key for that door. Any lights? Oh, we got a switch. Oh, there's definitely a rodent problem. And even the walls are ate up. Whoever you hired sucks, man. Everything's covered up down here. This must be where they did the storage. Rats, man, everywhere. Okay. Don't see nothing. Oh, key. Oh, there we go. We got some uh, eyeglasses. Some goggles. Report card. Reading CDFC. Written communication. DBCD. Man, someone's not getting a really good one. Excuse from class. Oh, grading period. One, two, three, four. They're not getting really good uh, grades here. They did good in music and art, but they suck in everything else. And they even got out of there for physical education. I don't want to move. I need a note. I used to love uh, PE. In my school, they had that sweat class, so you can actually lift weights. It was pretty cool. Oh, we got a violin. Is that a Stradivarius? Open. Nope, that's locked. Okay, we're going upstairs then. Hopefully I didn't miss any keys. 
some rope. Kind of look like a snake from Resident Evil. Oh, he's hobbling when I walk. Okay, yeah, so he definitely had the prosthesis. Open this. An artist's triumph. Gallery opening woes critics. Some call him the new Caravaggio. Or Vaggio. Others compare him to Van Eyck. And one awestruck critic who wishes to remain unnamed went as far to invoke the spirit of the great Leonardo. Any way you slice it, the exhibit proved an immense success. Distinct style has been praised for its unique combination of Renaissance influences and more progressive techniques. The artist himself attended the event in the company of his beautiful fiance, looking stunning in her black gown. Blank revealed to us exclusively that the couple are indeed expecting. Expecting a baby. All right, let's go upstairs. What we got here? Is that the baby? Came out with a full beard. That's creepy. Naked babies. Got a little thing to sit over there on the staircase. The doors are open. Oh, they got a big piano. Oh my god. What was that? Okay, that scared me. We got that alcohol. What's this? Sheet music. Okay. Okay, it doesn't want me to play. Doesn't want me to play that. My bad. What is going on over there? Okay, we're gonna look here first. Been working all night. Don't wake me up. Who's in here? Can I turn that off? That's a whole lot to read. The new face of music. A night at the opera becomes a night to remember. Blank might not be a household name yet, but just give her time. The incredible, talented, multi-instrumentalist gave an astounding performance last night, winning over even the most ardent naysayers. She was simply astonishing. I haven't seen such passion, energy, and skill in years, stated famed pianist Daniel Richter. He was not alone in his praise, it seems, that even Anthony Giles, one of Blank's harshest critics, has finally seen the light. Giles had previously made disparaging comments about the artist, stating that there's more to performing music than enthusiasm and a pretty face. When asked if, after witnessing last night's performance, he regrets these words, Mr. Giles gave us a look that can only be described as a mixture of awe and embarrassment. Pressed for an answer, he simply said, yes, we caught up with the stars. So that must be the lady. So she's a musician. And then we got Mr. Artist. And the creepy music. Oh, God. Okay. That scared me. That scared me. Okay. I'll admit it. Got enough bottles in there? Apparently she's a connoisseur in the drinking. God, I don't know why that made me jump so hard. Okay, let's keep going. Galactic's grand opening in flames. Disastrous fire at the new department store leaves dozens fighting for their life. The long-awaited opening of the Galactic department store turned into hell on Earth when the building's wiring burst into flames. While the majority of the visitors managed to reach the emergency exits in time, several unfortunate attendees were trapped in the back of the building. Having no chance to escape the raging inferno, the exact number of casualties has not yet been determined. Although it is estimated that a, at least a dozen people have been severely injured, the owner of the Galactic Ronald Shanefield uh, has so far declined to comment on today's tragic events. Oh, they got a little mirror in there, I think. Or a brush. No, those are brushes. Ooh, there's a ring. That's the ring he got her? Why should not win it? And why is she uh breaking a window here? Uh does these open? No. 
What about over here? She's got a cane? Sorry, couldn't sleep. The leg's been acting up again. Figured I might as well do some work. I love you. So her leg's acting up too? Or is that me? I'm confused. Well, maybe that's her side of the bed and maybe this is my side of the bed. Can I turn this thing on? No? Okay. Let's get out of here. I guess we'll go over here. Nope, it's locked. That's a no-go on that one. What about over here? Creepy face painting. What's going on in here? Is there any keys that we can get into the old artwork? Ah, look at that furry face. What's this? Oh, old Red Riding Hood. And not so Red Riding Hood. Holy macaroni. Hey. I'm sorry, I'll make it up to you tonight. It's all about you and me. Let's make it special. You promised. Little trouble in the old relationship, friend, huh? My dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some rough times right now. I really do. That's why I've agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place. For old time's sake, I even deliberately gave you a trivial task because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you can draw in your sleep. What I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare feel you submitted for a kid. Bedtime, or a kid's bedtime story. There is no way in hell I'm using this and I already regret agreeing to uh, payment in advance. Please get your shit together. Your old pal, Liam Brickstone. Whispered Tell Publishing House. Yeah, he was not happy about that. And okay, I think that's all there is for this room. Didn't miss nothing. Anything on the note? All right, let's head back over here. We got the key now. We didn't check over here. Oh, that's a ball. That one's locked. It's the kids' room. What's up here? Oh, it's a little play toy. Anything in here? Oh, a little brush, just like her mom. Oh, that's nice. That's pretty cool. Got a doggy pa uh, painting up there. Nice little chair, little house. Some spelling blocks. Sweet horse. Got a tea party going on. What do we got in here? Oh, got our little uh, clothes. All our trains. I want some trains. Okay, we got daddy, her, and why is mommy all scratched out? Got some crayons. Got a ton of blocks for those ABCs. Anything over here? And what's that say? Or harness? Eat? I don't know what that said. All right, let's keep going. Get out of this room. Go downstairs and open up the old painting room. It's right over here on the right. Oh, there's a clock here. Can I open that? No, okay. That was one of the ones that opens. Shut that door. All right, we're in. And the clock's talking. All right. There's all those paintbrushes. in this one. There it goes. Hold on, let me grab it. More paintbrushes. We got pictures. 
That must be his wife. Her face is all scratched out. She was pregnant. My love, even though you have not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. It's simply amazing. I just can't believe how lucky I am. A year ago, all I had was talent and ambition. Now, against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband, and you. I've never been a, de a deeply religious person. I guess what other people look for in a sermon. I found in perfecting my art. But now I can't help but feel like there's a higher power watching over me. They once told me that I would never succeed as a musician. Now I'm playing sold-out concerts at some of the most prestigious venues in the country. They also said I had a difficult character and that I would never find a soulmate. Guess again. Finally, a doctor once told me that I would never be able to have children of my own. And yet, here you are. Within me. I am quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. I love you so much. Did I, was that everything? I think that was all of it. Let's see. And then notes. Oh, something else. March 26th. All right. Let's try this again. Finally managed to play a little. If banging on the keys awkwardly counts as playing, I won't lie. It drives me insane to not have full control of my fingers. In any case, I was promptly berated by my loving husband who said I should be resting. I know he means well, but how will I ever get better if I don't work at it? The worst thing is I could swear I smelled liquor on his breath. God, please not this again. April 6. Found this little collection of empty bottles this morning. I reacted badly. I know it's hard for him too, but God damn it. He should know better. With a small child in the house? That's just irresponsible. June 17th. He's on about the damn rats again. I don't think I've ever seen one, but that doesn't stop him from laying out traps all over the place. He claims he can hear them in the walls and that there must be hundreds of them. God, I fucking hope it's true. I hope they crawl out at night and eat you in your sleep, you cruel, self-obsessed, pathetic drunk. Oop, somebody's angry. Any more? Still going. Empty. Okay, he turned into a drunk. Not so happy no more. Interesting painting right there. We got all sorts of stuff up here. The rats. Dust, mice, even in my lungs. Grotesque vermin, dirt. There is always more. Body borrowers feeding on me, driving me insane. Too fast to cut out. Lice, mice, bald, bloody spots. Hair, not mine. Where are the scissors? Minced mice, chunky, crunchy carcass, starving me out. Constantly sick. Fluffy fakers mocking me, lying still between toys. No toys allowed. Prosthesis snatchers, ins uh, insatiable bastards. Can't afford a new one. Why the damn leg? Oh, they're chewing the leg? Flapping horror. Be quiet. Constantly flapping, eating other rats. Plague breeder. Abomination. Is it the source? Haunts me in the nightmares. Silent floaters. They clog the drains. Fur in the water. No baths for me. Screeching arsonist. Echoing screams. They stop at nothing. I won't go down easy. This mo trucker's seeing rats of all kinds, doing everything to him. I think he's going crazy. I'm so sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sakes. Come talk to me when you're done, before you go to sleep. They didn't even talk to each other to send notes. Let me just give you an email. Anything in here? Not more rolls of paper. Looks like a war medal. And a sweet pipe. What do we got in here? Oh my goodness. Got enough alcohol in here. Okay, we can't open none of that. And we got this right here. Lost. You deserve it. Finished. Okay, finished it. Alright, let's get this. What's going on? Let's get it right this time on the ceiling there. Was that there before? I didn't even notice. Okay, the pictures seem to be the same. That's not the same. Things are changing. This is not the same. 
This okay. Oh, it's locked. The door shut. All right, I guess we're going forward. What is going on? Oh my god, the door shut turned to something else. Just out of reach. Oh god. Who slams a window like that? Make sure we don't miss nothing. We've got a pipe collection. Anything in here? Bottom drawer. Come on. Bottom. Nothing. Oh, there was. Reconnect with your partner. Rebuild the relationship. Rediscover the joy of marriage. Rekindle the flame. Don't worry, you're not alone. Perfect relationships may look great on the silver screen, but the rest of us mortals have to face the simple truth. Nobody's perfect. And you know what? That's fine. In fact, many loving couples struggle with day-to-day -day life and relationships. This does not make them any less special. It just takes some work, and we're here to help. Our consultants, all trained experts in their field, will help you identify the source of your troubles and deal with it. At your own pace. Whether it's simple miscommunication, money problems, or conflicting personalities, where there's a problem, there's always a solution. And remember, it's never too late. So they've been having relationship problems, obviously. Let's shut that up real quick. And he's a drunk. And she's got issues. And what about the kid? We got papers all over the place. Keep the light on. Going in circles. I don't feel like I'm going in circles. Let's go in here. There's gotta be a door here. It looks like a door would go there. Who are these guys? Are they painters? Yeah, light it. Whoa. What's going on with that? 485? We got ourselves a uh, lock. The past holds back. Look closer. Oh, what's that ring? Before I go over there, is there anything to read here? Got paints. Bunch of paper. Oh. Save the date. Request the pleasure of your company to celebrate their wedding on the Saturday, the 9th of June at St. Luke's Chapel at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Wedding day. Alright, let's grab that uh, ring. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, so will you marry me? Oh, well, she said yes, I guess. Oh, there is a door there. Never forget. Oh, I called it. There's some pain on that chair. You've been snooping around my workshop again, but for the last time, you are not allowed in that room. Even if the door happens to be open, I forbid it. This is your last warning. Next time, you'll have to look for a new job. I hear something over there. Like water or something. So I guess they had help, and that person kept going in there? What is going on with this thing? Why are you rocking? Looks like somebody's falling over there in that painting. Something weird about it, though. I don't know if that is a painting. It's like a doll. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. We're falling. <laughs> that was good. A trap door. That was good. Hello, creepy lady. Holes in the walls. Oh, there's a light. Hit that light. Oh god. Oh. Okay, okay. I'm going this way. 
What's going on with that? God, I knew she looked creepy. Okay, I'm, I'm leaving this area. I'm done with that. There's those rats again. Ooh, is this like a secret entrance? Pull the lever. It's gotta be behind a bookcase. Uh, that's weird. That is a bookcase. That creepy lady again. I don't like her. Then... Okay, I don't want to go right underneath it, because last time I fell through a hole in the floor. Let's look around, we got a door over here. Oh my god, when things close automatically. Okay. Can I touch it? Can I pet that dog? <laughs> Alright. Yep, yeah, no. 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 I'm not doing that. Uh, okay. Put on the big boy pants. Ooh. What's with all the creepy faces? Oh god! Ain't deep lies. What is that? Now a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> Interesting. I'm not that round. Looks fine to me. If that wasn't his wife, was he painting other women? Was there an affair? Alright. Okay, we got a door here. Like the last 100 of them. What do we got in this room? Something creepy, I'm sure. We got a wine glass. What is that? Did a rat just go in there? Oh! Ooh. Oh god! That gave me chills. Where'd the guy go? Okay. That was like a pile of books. We got another pen. Oh. Does that open up? Doesn't look like anything there. What's going on with this? Okay, I guess we're going back. Yep, different room. Trying to get pretty spoopy now. Pretty spoopy. Anything inside? Hey, in regards to your previous letter, I'm sure it's nothing to be too concerned about. Women tend to get weird after having a baby. Hormone imbalances and the like. When we had our first, I remember Valerie got the blues real bad. I would ask her what she wanted for lunch and she just burst into tears. Just be there for her and I'm sure it's gonna be fine. Now I know I promise not to rush you, and by all means, enjoy your well-deserved time off. But just let, uh, to let you know, I'm getting phone calls up the yin yang. Missions left and right. You're a hot ticket, my friend. Maybe we should strike the iron while it's hot, but of course the family comes first. Your friend and agent Thomas Cad uh, Caldwell. Okay, she's having the baby blues. She had the child and then her hormones are all out of whack and that's not good. Alright. What's through this door? Oh, that must be his wife. Can't open it. Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times. And yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Must be her brush. Got a door over there. And here. That one's locked.
Open up. Oh, paprika. We're in a pantry. Stop crying. Ooh, what's over there? And they got a lot of paprika in here. Why do you need so much paprika? Broken bottles. First step is the hardest. I don't like the sound of that. Oh, we gotta wait. We must weigh it down. What are we supposed to put over there? All this stuff to open again. Anything over here? Already opened all this. What was that? What is going on? It's falling out of the painting. Oh, and it's rotting. Oh, chill out, man. It ain't that serious. Anything in here? Nothing? Okay, uh, does it open? Oh, God! Whoa! What is going on? That's a lot of fruit! It's like popcorn. Oh, there's something First, here. I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hand steady. Wait a minute. Oh god. What do I do? I guess we go here? Did I make it back? Dear- oh, deep breaths. Remember, you're a professional. It's just the first few strokes. Then you're over the hump. What's so hard about it? And this is that book. I think it's the same. Yeah. Got all those. And... Oh, I think more is to it now. Eight, lost, even now. You deserve it. Finish it. And there's a few more words on that now. Okay. Can we put the skin thing on there? I think the painting's coming together. Looks like little, uh... Flamingos. Oh, this opened up. First, I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Oh, okay. That's what it said. So he cut his skin off or something? Wasn't that Van Gogh that did that? Like his ear or something? Shapeless dreams. Because he was using, uh, I think... Was it lead paint? And he got all crazy. Hey everyone, that was the end of episode one of Layers of Fear. If you guys enjoyed this content, hit that subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you can see more of it. And hit that like button so you can get this video spread to more stuff. If you also uh, like the content, why don't you leave some comments down below so I can hear what you think about it. And I'll see you in the next one. Later.